water industry, we provide 24-7 reliable water. It's unlike any other industry. You can go anywhere in this country and you know that the glass of water you're about to drink is safe. Although the quality of drinking water in the U.S. remains universally high, pipes and mains are frequently more than 100 years old and in need of replacement. There are an estimated 240,000 water main breaks per year. Costs to replace drinking water pipes over the coming decades may reach more than $1 trillion. We have old, decrepit pipes. That is a, a, a problem nationwide. These were all put in around the turn of the century. Cities were forming, were building these systems, and for decades, they didn't need to be replaced. We just had a pipe that we replaced this year that was 1875. I mean, that, that's incredible to me. You can only repair them for so long before you have to start replacing them. It, it's important to renew these structures, and it's important that we do it in a manner that is least disruptive to our customers and the taxpayers. We are the fundamental resource that every single job, every single building, every single residence relies upon. During heavy rainstorms, century-old sewers in many U.S. cities combine domestic wastewater and street runoff to pour untreated sewage into our lakes, rivers, and coastal areas. There are a number of things we can do to raise the grades for wastewater and drinking water systems. Our industry has to be so much more aggressive and assertive and customer oriented. We're doing everything we can think of to communicate better with our customers, even when there's a problem. Here's what happened, here's why, this is why solutions are needed. We need to look at public-private partnerships for both water and wastewater. We also need to look at some federal programs, such as an increase in our state revolving fund. The level of federal support for improving this infrastructure on a national basis has really declined. And that's despite the fact there's federal mandates driving a lot of our work. But at the end of the day, the users need to reconnect and invest in this system because they're the ones that are turning on the tap every day. And they have to agree that if they want the quality of life, they want the economy they've enjoyed, they're going to have to make that investment.